Marines from 40 Commando trying to find the enemy. This may look like standard commando training, but there's a difference. Future Commando 4's concepts are being tested. Well, here at Bovington, there are around 60 personnel from 40 Commando. They're split into three troops, all trying to find and fight each other. They're experimenting with some new equipment and alternative team structures. Marines need to get used to working in formations of varying numbers. Traditionally, they have worked in sections of eight, but now teams of different sizes could be broken down to smaller bespoke groups for specialist operations. Rather than being deployed from the UK, now Marines might be expected to be permanently on a ship in the Middle East or the Mediterranean or serving on an aircraft carrier. This is so groups of high readiness Marines can be in a forward position for missions at a moment's notice. Move back! We're just trialling everything. So, like, regards to, like, small, small man teams, instead of pushing out of sections, we're going as four, four man teams and sort of seeing how it works and how we could deal with casualties and, and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's still a bit of trial and error at the moment. There are also some very nuanced changes. Troops on the ground will have more autonomy when they carry out tasking so they can work in a more focused way, tailoring the expertise that are needed for whatever mission they are sent on. For these Marines, it's a chance to contribute and develop future commando force. As Marines, our input from exercises like this and others is really being used to help form the concept. So you can use uh, what goes well, what goes badly, uh, and essentially build that into what we hope to be a really great future commander force concept over the next uh, coming years. Tiny moving. Not used on this exercise, but coming soon, the Marines will have new uniforms and new weapons. Autonomous technology is already being tested and integrated too. But despite the transformation, there are still fundamental skills Marines need that will never change. If you're hunting the enemy, making sure the enemy can't find you. Those basic skills are essentially the foundation that everything's built upon. Uh, so there's no use having fancy kit or the equipment if you don't have those basics drilled down. So the purpose of this week uh, is essentially to trial future commander force concepts. Uh, and the especially important part is it's force on force. And that's where not being seen really comes into play. Uh, so as you can see now, we're cammed up. We have cam cream on our faces. Uh, when we are closer to enemy, we'll cam up. Uh, parts of our webbing, parts of our uh, plate carriers as well. As we're force on force, it can be really easy to get seen, get pinged, and just one small mistake can essentially lead to your entire operation being disrupted. Training with elements of experimentation will continue as future commando force pursues a more agile and lethal capability for the UK. Thanks.